I'm at a rock solid martial arts right now where twice a week they hold this boxing class. Now that might not seem newsworthy in itself, but what is likely to surprise you is what all of the people here have in common. They are all punching back against Parkinson's. It's a baffling disease that comes in different degrees and forms, often making the things most of us take for granted much more difficult to do. I noticed the left side started moving slower and the coordination wasn't as good. Well, I was a runner and my foot was bothering me for quite a long time. He just started not working so well. Judge Gregory Todd began to notice one of the most common symptoms shortly before he retired from the bench. I, when I was holding papers, they would they would kind of rattle and uh, it was very obvious that uh, that that tremor was affecting uh, my holding it and so that that prompted them going to a neurologist and, and verifying it. The culprit, Parkinson's disease. Approximately 90,000 people are diagnosed with Parkinson's each year in the U.S., but in this class, they're doing everything they can to fend it off. And that means throwing a few punches. Nice. The Rock City Boxing Program at Rock Solid Martial Arts focuses on improving the quality of life for those battling Parkinson's. Jonathan Waterfall is the owner and instructor of the class. And it can help, you know, building that muscle, um, firing those neurons can really help um, with the Parkinson's uh, symptoms. It's a lifesaver. In what way? Uh, able to move, more flexibility. Parkinson's has no cure. It's a progressive disease where symptoms most often get worse over time. But studies have shown that moderate to high intensity exercise can slow the progression. This, this tends to at least slow down the advance of symptoms of the Parkinson's. So uh, as well as just a general feeling of, of, of fitness and, and, uh, and, and well-being. You no know, one knows what the prognosis is going to be over a period of time, but seems to slow it down. Along with boxing and other physical exercises, they also work on their balance. Ready, go. And how to handle a fall, something that can be an issue for people with Parkinson's. They're, they're fighting for a better quality of life, um, whether it be to get down and play with their grandkids or to... Um, to just be there for their family. There's also that common bond that those in the class share, which makes it easier to punch back at Parkinson's. The focus, and he mixes things up, it's fun, and the social part of the whole thing, we're all in the same boat, just at different stages. I've exercised my whole life. It's one thing that I must do. I, I just have to do it. It's my therapy, it's my medicine. Programs like this one are making a big difference in the lives of Parkinson's patients.